There's a scary Halloween Ooh, pumpkin for cue you. Cue the spooky music. Yes, um, Halloween, eight days away. So if you're like me and you haven't purchased your costume yet and you're wondering what it's gonna, how this is gonna go down, we're here to help. Yes, and Betty Pitcher with Beck Center for the Arts is here with last minute costumes that are easy to put together. And you can literally do this yourself, correct? Yes, yes. All right, first up, Zeus. This one's super easy. Yes. Um, Everybody should have a bed sheet. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I yeah. mean, let's hope we all have a bed sheet. Our, um, we did ours out of material, but this particular one is could be made with a bed sheet. Um, the sash, the gold sash, could be a tablecloth or... Oh, okay. um, Yeah, so you could use what you have around your home to... Um, and, or purchase from... Like craft supplies, yes. any, craft, any. craft supplies, or fabric stores, or even your local Walmart. And the kids get to help, which is super fun. Yes. Yes. Right? They would have to help me with any of these because <laughs> there's no way I'm able to make that. And the lightning bolt thing is cool I too. Love. This, this one in particular is made out of wood and paint. Right. But you could do it out of cardboard and tin foil. Okay, very good. Poster totally. board. Yes. Yeah, yes. Yellow poster absolutely. Board. Next up, I recognize that you are one of the seven dwarfs. You're not fooling me. Um, <laughs> Um, tell us how you how you made this, and it, it does look like it's r relatively simple. Yeah, it is. It's um, made just from a simple T-shirt, and um, throw some buttons on. They can oh, nice. be glued or sewn, whichever you um, have it. Right. Um, this is just felt that we fashioned into a belt. That's so creative. Um, the hat is made. This particular one's made out of fleece, but it can be um, felt or whatever. And right now he is sneezy. <laughs> but if you wanted him to be Doc, you give him the glasses. I, you just yes, Adore he can this. be oh Glock, my. or yes. you can add ears and become dopey. Very nice. Okay. So push the level of your creativity. That to is the three costumes in one right there. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. <laughs> That's great. Okay, and then last, this is Janice King, Harold's assistant in the Trials of Robin Hood. Yes, our, the, this is our upcoming production this weekend at the Beck Center. Oh, good for you. Um, and this costume was actually made by our costume assistant, who is also the stage manager, Joy DeMarco, who has very um, beginner sewing skills. Okay. Beginner sewing skills? Yes. So a little That's more tremendous. costly to make something like that one um, or not necessarily crafty? We maybe? use, we yeah, more, some, this would be more for somebody with a little bit of sewing um, knowledge no, I'm or just crafters. Like no, no, I'm or crafters. <laughs> well, can you use a glue gun? Because a lot of it is glued or hand sewn. All right. Well, Betty, thank you so much. Awesome. And thank you to our costume wearers. You guys look great. Sneezy, that was good acting. You've got a future. <laughs> um, by the way, if you want to see The Trials of Robin Hood, it great. starts playing at the Beck Center tomorrow. It runs through Sunday. Betty, thanks. Thank you. We so wrap up lunch break after you. this. Yeah.